All right, I got to compose myself. That is easily my biggest bass this year. Uh, just got done measuring it 21 inches long. That is 21 inches. So uh, it's fall of the year. A lot of the real shallow weeds have already died. It's early this year. It is uh, first or second of September. It's the Sunday of Labor Day weekend. And uh, I caught my limit of bluegills this lake. It's only 10 bluegills. They're all nice. I'm going to go home and fry them up. And I had some time to kill, so I'm like, dude, I'm going to go bass fishing. And I was trying off the deep, what's left of the deeper weed edge, not doing anything. Heard uh, surfacing in these reeds next to me. Threw on a swim jig, nothing, water's kind of dingy. Put on a chatterbait. A little bit ago, I landed a really nice 16-inch bass. Uh, and heard one near me. Decided to swing back around. It's past the spot I already did throughout uh, my chatterbait and this bass just absolutely inhaled it uh, it was one of those where you set the hook and you don't move the fish initially uh it took to the air and i knew i had a really big fish on as soon as i saw him his mouth was absolutely huge uh took me a while to land it pull and drag i had to, I had to clint cinch down my drag kept it out of the reeds i was able to lip it get it in the boat so we're gonna weigh it in just a sec Whew. All right, buddy. Thank you for a really good end of a good day. Ah.